look, whenever you're a youngster, no matter what age you were, to play in a cup final at any stage, you know, no matter what the level or the standards, fantastic. But to play in the Irish Cup final is mm -hmm. really very... Now, you've been there, you know what it's like. Yeah. But uh, what's it like for a player on the day or the build-up to that week? I think um, the build-up, obviously, you get the nerves, and especially the day before and the day off, the nerves are there. and. Um, I don't think you can really enjoy it till after the game, and obviously you need to win it as well. But um, I think once once you've you've played the game, you're sort of concentrating and don't don't make mistakes, don't make a mistake. And I think once that you get out and you win the game, fingers crossed, um, then you start to enjoy it. You start to enjoy it with the family, enjoy it with the fans, and we we do. Previous years we've done we tour of sort of East Belfast around the supporters clubs and it's brilliant to get involved with them because they're right behind us and they know the sort of the struggles of the clubs and um, the Irish Cup's a fantastic sort of cup for the, the club over the years and say so after the game is is probably the the main time you can get to enjoy it. You talk about the cup, you know, and you obviously you were there a couple of years ago, so I presume the routine probably won't change uh, for cup final week and for cup final day for you. No, we've, see, Eddie's tried to keep everything the, as, as close to the same as possible. Um, we're doing everything the exact same, the pre-match meals are the exact same. Um, we're going to go and get the suits this week at some stage, and no doubt um, we'll try and keep those the, the, the same as well. So everything... Is, is, is the pre preparation is across the board is trying to be the exact same as a couple of years ago and hopefully the result is the exact same. Elliot, as a player, you know, you've been there a long time, you know, a uh, Crusaders fan, I suppose, initially, when you think about it, now you're playing for Glen because you want to win. But it's marvellous when you get a lift like this to play in a cup final like that. You know, you have been there and done that. And there's other lads who are coming through. And mm -hmm. we're talking to Eddie about it as well, too. You talk about going there in the supporters club. The fans... It gives that entire community there a serious lift, doesn't it? It does. Um, I think uh, if you look back at it, I don't know what our average gates are, maybe 1,500 or something, but, and then you go to the Irish Cup final and you're talking like, you're talking six, 7,000 uh, people there and everyone's just buzzing for it. Um, I think even last year we played Portadown down there and the noise and the atmosphere was unbelievable. We ended up, we beat them 1-0. So it's it's just a fantastic trophy. It's a fantastic day. Um, it's the marquee sort of day of the year in the football season, um, and it's just it's great to be part of it. And um, but it's all about winning it. You need to win it. And I say, fingers crossed, we can go out and get the same result we did a couple of years ago. Elliot, thanks very much Good for man. joining us on the TV. Thank you. Thank you.